it's the day before our trip and we have a couple things on our checklist that we like to do before we leave the next day. One of those being plug in the trailer because we don't run our trailer on propane while we drive to keep the refrigerator cold. What we do is we plug the trailer in, cool down the refrigerator overnight because we don't want to put cold food in a hot fridge. And then we have frozen water bottles that help keep the refrigerator cold as we drive. Hopefully. So the first thing we're gonna do is plug in our trailer. Now that we've got the trailer plugged in, now we are going to check the refrigerator, make sure it's on, make sure it's running, so we can get it cooled down before we load in our food. Now we're just gonna check, make sure that the electric is on, thermostat, that's it. Now the refrigerator is on, let that cool overnight so we can load the food up in the morning before we leave. So another thing we like to do before we leave is check the tire pressure on the tires. Having good tire pressure is a good way to prevent blowouts and you definitely don't want to blow out on the road. So always check your tire pressure before you leave. All right, another good thing to check on your tires before you leave or actually to check on your wheels before you leave is to check all your lug nuts. Make sure your lug nuts are tight. That way you don't have any issues on the road. We have seen some horror stories about lug nuts being loose and basically your tire, your wheel falling off while you're driving. So. Make sure to check your lug nuts. So we got two out of four tires that need a little bit of air pressure, so it's good that we check before we leave. Now, let's go see what Donna's doing. Hey babe, what hey. you doing? The important stuff. You checking tire pressure and all the lugs? I'm making sure that we're fed for the whole trip. What are we cooking? Breakfast tacos. Right. I'm a lazy camper y'all didn't know. I do all the hard work before we go so I don't have to do any of this stuff when we're there. How you doing? You made a really funny What? What are you doing? <laughs> instead of six like you think? I, I'm thinking six, 15. I'm gonna tell this on you. So we finally got to Garner. Seven so, hours, by the way. So the last time we were here, there was a hour long wait to register. And what? now it doesn't look like there's a line. So cross your fingers, we'll let you know how it goes. So checking in wasn't that bad. Luckily they weren't busy. I got to pull a number and got in. Be prepared if you come to Garner that it's like the DMV and you might have to pull a ticket and wait a little while. So if you've seen our video before, you know that we like to hike bike ride and swim we go camping and Garner checks off all those boxes. So let's go check out a couple of those hikes right now where we get to see a cave and Daphne gets to ride her bike on a trail for the first time. And then we're gonna show you our favorite part of Garner State Park. You ready? You all packed up and ready to go? Yeah, I'm starting to wonder our method on this. The I carry, the water. Water's heavy. Full bladder, two full bottles. Go pee if you got a full bladder. Can't wait to get on the hike again. You ready to get this hike started? Yeah. Someone want to drink half this water first? <laughs> hey, um, will you grab this bag for me? Yeah. No, not like that. Uh. <laughs> once we get halfway done because the water will be mostly gone. So this one really is strenuous? Yeah, especially when I'm carrying all the weight. Garner wasn't lying? Uh-uh. Maybe we should just go back. You need to pack a thousand water bottles. Ugh. What is this? Here. Oh, finally! I mean, doesn't it kind of sound like it's a Scooby-Doo setting? Crystal, Crystal cave. cave. Where's the mystery machine? 
It's a case for us, Mystery Ink. Mm, I'm Daphne, of course I am, because my name is Daphne. Okay, I'll be Scooby. No, say Scooby, you're, you're Velma. I'm Shaggy. Velma? Why? She's smart and you're smart. All right, Shaggy. Velma's in love with Shaggy, just to know. Okay, so you are Shaggy. <laughs> Because we love each other, so either way, that's right. We love each other. Where's Crystal Kay? Right there, yo. Trying to show the people. Right there. Right there. Right there. slip inside my way out. Hey. What? We coming out or what? For short people. Ah. Without backpacks. <laughs> short people without backpacks. Okay. I did that with mine just now. I haven't had anything to drink. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, uh, what do we take? Okay, so we just did the Madrone walkway, Madrone, sorry, Madrone. Madrone walkway to the Crystal Cave Trail, to the Bridges Trail, and then back on the Madrone walkway. Crystal Cave Trail was strenuous, just like they say. Mm -hmm. Taking the Bridges Trail down was nice and shady, but... It is a climb down. It's a climb, I mean... With the view, you have a view of the big river area. Yeah, and you know, with my toes at the front of my hiking boots, didn't feel that great. Where are your best shoes? Mm-hmm. You know, swap my Keens for some Merrill. Okay. Wink, wink, Merrill. <laughs> I'm ready to go! <laughs> I'm ready to go! <laughs> yeah, I'm ready to go! Let's go. Frio Canyon Trail, 2.9 miles. Yeah, this is part of the nature trail. It just, I looked over and I saw a bridge and I didn't know what this trail was. That was so close. It's the nature trail that's by park headquarters. Doing all the things. Oh yeah. So we just finished the Frio Canyon Trail and that was Daphne's first trail ride. Oh. It was easy, what, 2.9 miles, right babe? And easy, wide, <laughs> and lots of harvester ants. Don't stop, watch your feet. Yeah, but it's pretty flat. If you have a kid that is experienced on trails, it's pretty easy for kids. Yes. <laughs> Good morning. Is everybody ready to go? Yep. I'm still tired because you woke me up so early. Yeah, and I'm a walking So we have a kid. change of plans. Yeah, and I'm the walking Sadie girl right now. We're uh, not going to do all Old Baldy. We're doing, well, I'll find the name of the trail later. Um, <laughs> oh. Because I think it would be more enjoyable for all of us if, if we didn't hike all the way up to Old Baldy. You know what I mean? So when she's a bit older, we'll do, we'll do Old Baldy we'll do that next hike. time. It's got some elevation. Yeah. yeah. I'm just looking Wild at the Wild Horses safety something guy. trail. Creek trail? Wild Horse Creek Trail. There you go. Bad dad. Bad dad, bad dad, bad dad, bad dad. Why am I a bad dad? You want to tell him? Well, you ate all the Skittles. Okay. And you only left four for me. 
That's it? That's not very bad. That's the only reason I'm a bad dad? Yeah. I think everybody would think I'm pretty good. You also hit me in the eye with a saw. Oh. What am Is I? he good or bad? What am I? Leave a comment below. So the reason we love Garner State Park so much is because of the Frio River. Crystal clear, cool waters. You can just lounge around in the splash pools or you can get your inner tubes, you can ride down the rapids. It is just a relaxing, fun time and we love hanging out in the water when we go to Garner State Parks. So here's just a little taste of what it's like hanging out in the Frio River at Garner State Park. Hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, click right now to check out another great Texas State Park. Again, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time on Our Gold Road.